In this video I'm going to make a beat using a really cool free sample pack. Let's do it. What's up, this is Marcello. If you're interested in beat making videos, tutorials and more, consider subscribing. So today I'm going to make a beat using my free sample pack which contains uh, about 65 samples. If you're on my email list, I already sent you the link to download the free pack. Uh, so check your emails. If you're not on my email list and want to check out the pack, uh, you'll find the link in the description. Also this pack is only a light version of a much bigger pack which contains about 230 samples or something like that. Um, which you can also get in the description. Alright, if you like the samples and want to support the channel, you can also buy me a beer or a coffee. Uh, link in the description as well. Alright, enough talking, let's dive in. Alright, we got an empty project. Um, let's go to Browse, Places, My SD Card, uh, Samples, Marcello, and let's load up the Marcello Knock Knock 2.0 Lite. Here you can see A8s, drum loops, hi-hats, instrumental one-shots, kicks. Here we got the MPC drum program, melodic loops, percussion loops, percussive one-shots, snares, effects. So it's a lot of um, stuff. And I put all of that into one program. It's like a quick start to making beats, maybe. So you can get started really uh, quick. So let's go into the program. Let's choose this program symbol. And now let's load it, load it up. Load it up. All right, now let's go to main. And here you can see I um, made some different colors. Here we got some kicks in brown. Then we got some snares, hi-hats, yellow, and 808 in gray. Then on bank B, we got the same layout, orange, heads, 808s, and here we got some uh, modified 808s. I modified them using the LFO section in the uh, program edit. You can tweak the 808s further. So on bank C we got some percussion, and here in blue we got some um, percussion loops so they are um, synced to the BPM of the current project so if I increase the BPM the percussion loop will increase or decrease all right, now, all right, in the light green we got some melodic one shots on bank D. And on bank E, 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 on bank E we got some weird What's wrong? Some weird effects. And then up there in light green again, we got some melodic loops. I think my sister played that on the piano. I played that on the drums. My uncle played that on the piano. This one is nice. So this is the whole drum uh, kit, the light version. The full version is a lot more sounds. So the full version has, I think, 230 sounds or something like that, something. And this one has 65. So it's a lot more in the, in the full version. 
All right, so um, let's let's get started. How should we start? Um, I think I'm going to chop up a loop. Or maybe just take a loop. We don't want to chop up today. We don't want to chop up today. The, the melodic loops are also synced uh, to the BPM. Let's take this one, I like that. But maybe let's uh, pitch it a little bit. make it 124 BPM maybe and let's just record this loop. Okay. Let's leave it uh, four bars. So now let's add some, let's, let's add a kick. I'm going to put it all on one track um, and later then um, I'm going to export, uh, explode the whole, the one track and so it, it will put every, it will put each sound on uh, its own track. Okay, let's do this. Let's add a hi hat. I like that one. Let's play it with 16 levels velocity. It's a big surprise. Okay. Let's add some hi-hat rolls. I like that. Let's add something else. Let's add some percussion maybe. Let's actually um, double the length of the sequence to make some variations. I like that. Um, let's just save it to make sure. So why we wait? Let me tell you a story about an old man who realized that is okay. It's done. Um, now let's continue. Oh, I like that one. This one has to go in there. Let's play it with 60 levels tune.
And now let's add some 808. Okay. Um, for the 808, you can see I added a mother ducker to each 808 and deactivated it. So the 808 uh, is often clashing with the kick because they share the same frequencies. So if you want to um, make sure that doesn't happen, you can just activate the mother ducker on the 808. So on each 808 sound, we got a mother ducker deactivated. Um, and on the kicks, we got the mother ducker input already placed. So you don't have to dive into the menu so you can just activate it or and, and then adjust it. Um, all right, now let's add the 808. Let's find the right sound. Okay, maybe let's take this one because it has more low end. It's a little bit distorted, but that's okay. Let's actually take this 808 and copy it to some other pads. So let's go to bank F for that. Let's just copy, hold copy. Press the 808 and then we go to bank F and let's put it here. So now let's, now we can just um, take our time and stri um, take our time with the next, uh, with the next notes, so that's the first one. Let's try to put it on the kick. And as you can see, I um, loaded up some effects on the program, so you can just, it, it will sweeten the whole thing, this is without, it's pretty, you know, dark and it gets lighter if you activate them. Okay, I just noticed something, um, let's go to program edit. I noticed that in the beginning I um, changed the tune of the melody, um, but I changed the tune of the whole program. So I changed the tune of the whole program, also of the drum sounds. So let's see how everything sounds in its original tune. This is also a pretty cool uh, feature if you only have one program. You can just try out different um, pitches or different, different tunes for the whole beat. So let's see how the whole thing sounds one semitone down. The whole vibe changes. So if I want to have every single instrument on their own track, I just go to track and explode. So now it will explode every single instrument to its own track, as you can see. Um, now what is also cool about one program, having one program, we can automate some XYFX on the program. We can't automate it on the outputs. I don't know why this uh, doesn't work, but we can automate it on the program. So let's just take this.
enjoyed the video and want to check out the free drum kit, uh, link is in the description. Or if you're already on my email list, um, just check your emails. I emailed the drum kit to you. And yeah, leave a like, a comment, the whole shebang. And um, see you next time. Peace.